Today we are going to be cooking tomato soup. Tomato soup. I hate soup. Do you like pumpkin soup? No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. No, you don't. No, I don't. <laughs> By the way, hello everyone, and we are the Fresh Kids of East London, and today we are doing yam. Mm. You're supposed to do it with me. Yam. Mm. No. Three, two, one. Yam. Yum. Yum. Mm. <laughs> Sisters. Okay. Should we start? Yeah. So, blue. You need to wash your hands. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Sleeve it up. Oh, I think it fell into the sink. It smells nice, though. Oh, this is like gel. Where's the key towel? Inside the drawer! Oh, hey. <laughs> hey. Why didn't you just use the As you can see, the first ingredient is four tablespoons of olive oil. Olive oil. One small onion chopped. One small carrot chopped. <laughs> Two sticks of celery chopped. One garlic crushed. One tablespoon of paint flour, chopped tomatoes, tomato puree, fresh thyme, vegetable stock, a pinch of sugar, and salt and pepper for seasoning. <laughs> okay. Now it's time for the show. I've got a question on yum. Our first contestant is Willow. Give her a clap. Yay! Okay, basically blue. I have a question. Now, on I have a question, we are going to be starting off with Willow again because she, look at this beautiful face. Just think, look at it. Blue. I have a question is the best show, Yam Edition. I have a question. So, you know pickles? They're just pickles. They're not pickles, they are just pickles. But then why do they have to go ahead and pickle onions? Everybody likes onions and pickles. They, why can't they pickle like potatoes? Yeah, that's disgusting. Yeah, but so is pickled onions. Wait. Why do they I have can't. to pickle something? Why don't they? Why don't like cucumbers pickle something? Should we move on? Yeah. And show our utensils. So the first thing you will need is a measuring cup. You will also need a, a chopping knife. A mixing spoon. A Star Wars device. Oh, a measuring spoon. <laughs> I think this is a garlic grater. Garlic it's called a garlic crusher. Okay. Big fat frying pan that can make your butt look big. Okay, a chopping board. Where do I put this now? This electric um, neutral bullet or, um, or a blender. You'll also need I have a draw, I have a draw. Um, I have a draw. I didn't know. <laughs> oh jeez, calm. I need mm -hmm. this peeler to peel your carrots. Yeah. Oh yeah, we need to peel the carrots as well. Yeah. So, I'm, so you see this carrot, I, am, I don't know what this bit is for. I think this was the root, but I think roots maybe kind of like look like hay. What? Just keep on peeling. Don't don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Please don't. Oh my gosh! My chopping board has a hole in it. I must have been really chopping it up. Dun, dun. Right. <laughs> now, what we're going to do first is we're going to peel our carrots. Then we're going to chop our celery, and then we're going to chop our onions. And try not to cry. What do you do when you're cutting an onion? Oh, this looks so You great. cry. I know how to chop stuff. I've chopped a cucumber, tomato. I've actually chopped um, carrots. Yes, I've chopped carrots. And I have. And them. and you chop, yeah, because you don't like cooking. I, hey. I know how to cook pasta and stuff. Yeah. How do you know I don't like? Uh, I like. I know how I to cook this way rice, too much. macaroni. You're supposed to cut it off. You can use this as a pen. Look. See? You just need to put some ink on the end and dip it into the ink. <laughs> the carrot life lightsaber! The new character, Bluebell! It could also be a trumpet. <laughs> Raising that up. 
eyebrow, Willow. You need to raise an eyebrow and open up your shirt. Mm -hmm. Blue. Okay, we have to carefully use a sharp knife to cut up our carrots. They're rolling around everywhere like crazy. I'm going to stack my carrots now. You can use carrots as many things, like dominoes, I'm wheels of carrots. an amazing, ginormous big car. They can even be stacks, like how Willow's doing it. But watch this. This is so amazing what you can do with it. Oh. <laughs> I thought it could be. And now, if we put them on top of here, we can make a castle like this. Ah. Oh no, they're not equal. If we go like. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. Another thing that you the can use castle. carrots as crazy eyeballs. <laughs> now, now let's pull the onion. Can we start this time, Blue? This is what I like to do when I'm, um, how do you peel an onion? Oh right, I'm professional, I, I know how to peel one. So you do this. I put a spoon in my mouth so I don't cry. That's and I, when you cut it's it. done! No, you still have to do more. Huh? Oh, now I understand. You're all from the top. I'm professional! Okay, now we do the rest of them. This is oh, I've still got onion more piece. difficult than you think. Make sure when you're cutting onions, you have an adult around to make sure that you're being safe. Our dad's over there. Say hi, Dad. Hello. Mm -hmm. I'm so addicted to carrots because do you know why? I think you don't. I was born in a carrot farm, basically. No, you weren't. I was there when you were born. Now we have to chop two sticks of celery. I guess I was just like. Take two sticks of these then. I was also born in a celery farm. No, you weren't. You see the scar? It was from the carrots. Oh, we're supposed to be cutting the celery. Yeah, you can cut yours in a second after. I can also it. use that as a lightsaber. No, you can't. Yeah! God. Luke Skywalker! And you said you're a professional cook. Because you're again using a sharp knife. Okay, Blue, now it's your turn. Thank you. Careful with the knife. Juicy. While Blue's cutting her celery, I'm going to heat up a pan with some olive oil. About four tablespoons. Okay, so I'm, I've got a tablespoon, so I'm going to measure four of these and put it in the pan. You almost finished, Blue? Yep. Into the bin you go. Bye bye. Have a nice holiday with the worms. What? Our pan's on medium heat, so we're going to crush our garlic and get our flour ready. I'm just going to peel it. See, look, it looks exactly like. What are you doing? Why are you smelling your fingers? Look, garlic and onion looks exactly the same. This looks like a tiny onion. No, it doesn't. It looks like a tiny pumpkin, you mean? It does not look anything like a pumpkin. It looks like a white pumpkin. It really doesn't, Blue. Let's sing a song. The garlic song. Garlic, garlic, garlic. Oh, I did not know we had a garlic song. It's from France, you know. You know, I was also raised in France. Mm -hmm. My face was on the Eiffel Tower. Imagine that. Mm -hmm. And I was like this. If you think so. And I was also raised by cats. By cats? I peeled my garlic. Now, Blue, you can peel a piece of garlic for yourself. Thank you. This looks like a bum. What's that? Did I just break it? Nothing's broken. Oh wait, no, it is. The top bit came off. A few moments later. Well, I've crushed some garlic. My grandma taught me how to do this. Oh, that was easy. Now we're gonna put our ingredients in the pot to cook. Okay, so we're gonna add our onion, celery, and our carrots. No garlic yet. I'm gonna add those to the no pan. Way. It's garlic, isn't it? No, no garlic. Hmm. Okay, so I'll get my. Don't spatter them because the oil's probably still hot. Putting in my um, okay. celery. Can I put in my celery? Okay. Another onions. It smells disgusting. 
and then you start to mix. I'm not ready, Always make sure you're I'm not ready. Oh, you still got some onions. They're called, it's called celery. It's Always make sure you're holding the pan handle when you're mixing. Oops. So it doesn't... We're getting some trouble here, aren't you, Lee? You want to stir your vegetables until they're soft. Next, we're going to put in our garlic and our flour. You only need this in for about five Ooh. minutes. Oops. Oh, well done. Okay, and now I've got the flour. Yummy, yummy. Is this yummy. enough? Yeah. You've really got loads of flour on your hands, though. Okay. You're just stirring the flour and the garlic for only a minute. Now I'm going to get the tin tomatoes. I'm going to pour them in. So... It might be the tin opener. Um, Unless you can open it like that. A professional papa. My well, daddy's opening up the tin tomatoes. We're going to keep on mixing. How's it going, Willow? Are they getting soft? No. There you go. Thank you. I'm going to add all of it. OK. This is the main thing of the tomato sauce. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to put one tablespoon of tomato, tomato puree. Uh, uh, uh. While Willow's mixing whatever she's mixing, I think it's veg, um, I'm going to add a tablespoon of apple puree. You mean tomato puree? That's like a poop. Next, I'm going to put in my vegetable stock. Okay, I put all of it in, so here you go. Don't let it splash. Oh gosh, I'm going to add in now a pinch of sugar, maybe another pinch, because I've got small fingers you now. Now we'll bring the mixture to the boil and let it simmer for 25 minutes. A few moments later. So our dad poured the mixture into this pot from the pan and then we're going to add some thyme to it. So let's do that now quickly, Blue. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Can you use it as perfume? Really? I feel like they need to be passed in it because it smells oh, like wait a like second. Sauce. Smell the thyme. Ooh. It sounds like it's eight o'clock. You mean smells? <laughs> okay. Turn that. <laughs> Pulsing Addy Cass. Do you mean to try? <laughs> nice and easy. This is the Pulsing Addy Cass soup. Pulsing Addy Cass! Now I'm going to pour it into here. You sure that that bit? And I hope it all fits. Oh. Oh, that looks disgusting. It looks like vomit. Now we press it down for it to mix. Ah! It got stuck. Okay, um, I'll pick a bit more. So get our mug. We mm -hmm. can go get our mug. Willow has this amazing frozen cup. It's Disney! <laughs> Here you go. Okay. This is for you. Okay then. This is B. Make four more times. Okay. Stand back, everybody. Stand back. Stand back. Okay. It could explode. I don't think it will, Blue. Oh, it's so still good. a bit lumpy. It looks like pumpkin soup, not tomato soup. Tastes like carrots. It does taste a little bit to like Elsie. Like. It, it just looks doesn't like look vomit, like like orange vomit. Well, I don't want to eat it now. Okay, well, there's still, still some leftover, so we can yeah. save that. She later. didn't. Well, I didn't put that much in hers because she doesn't quite like it. We'll tidy up a bit and then it's time for the taste test. Remember when you make this, you should always have a grown-up with you because it's very hot. So you should have a woman, a man, they're perfect. Okay, basically, it kind of looks, it looks more orange than red. It looks it kind of like pumpkin like, soup. It smells like tomatoes. So it doesn't really look like vomit anymore. Can you taste it? Jiggly. Do you, yes. you want a spoon? I'm, I'm drinking it, I think. Okay. Am I, wait, I'm just going to get a spoon just for emergency. Because I might be Emergencies. hot. Emergencies. Yeah. Okay. Spooning. Yuli blue? Yep. Let's go. This doesn't fit in my Elsa cup. <laughs> oh, that's actually delicious. It does not taste like woman in any sort of way. It kind of does. <laughs> it does not taste like vomit. It's hot, but it actually tastes very good. It's really good. It looks like pumpkin soup. It smells delicious, like tomato. I, I actually don't like tomato. soup, and I actually like this. Thanks for watching another episode of Yum. Mm. Mm. This is really good. Mm. Mm. Delicious. Mm. Daddy, come and taste. See you next time on Yum. Mm. 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 Yum, yum, yum. Yum.
Yummy. Mm.